hero to show you the way. Call me now for your free reading. Now the Griff is on life support. Hey y'all, gravity, any day above ground, live it. So you already know what to do. Share, like, and subscribe. That's right, share, like, and subscribe because I'm not like other YouTubers. I'm different. November 5th, the Griff is over. But we're only here on May 11th. And people are really still holding on to the Griff. Ladies and gentlemen, here you are on screen. Candace Owens. We all know who Candace Owens is. Provocateur. Celebrity. Grifter. Yes. What to do when your employer fires you and you got to make some money? I mean, you have a husband. You have income that's in the house that you both share. You don't want to touch that. I get it. You want to leave it for the progeny. I get it. But you have to go out and have another job because God forbid you sit in the house all day and you're at the whims of your nanny. Hmm. So what do you do? You join a service where you can get paid giving people advice damn I wish Dare Abby would have known this about 30 years ago she might be a billionaire by now but anyway on your screen is something called Manek now I've done our research we've done the research you're going to be quite surprised where I'm about to take this I think it might be confirmed allegedly Candace Owens might be going to Valuetainment which again flies in the face of her <laughs> if that if my prediction comes true that she goes to value team it's going to fly in the face of everything she did and she said after getting fired from the daily wire but again it's just speculation it's based on things that i found but anyway the reason why we're here, family, is because of this. Now, again, this is kind of like Cameo. If those who don't know what Cameo is, it's basically a bunch of celebrities that get on there and you pay a fee based on whatever tier service you want. And they send either yourself or other people personalized messages to someone you love or someone such as yourself. But I'm guessing this Manek is one-on-one. -on -one. Okay. So her rates are... Now, first off, who wrote this? You can't write. <laughs> it's book a call, not booking a call, but okay. So it says, quick question. Ask a text question and choose the response format you want. So it says text answer. You pay $100. So you pay this, send her, her a text message, and she'll send you a text message back. And my wife brought up a good point. How do you know that's her? Okay. Video answer. Get a recorded video response to a text question. So again, you pay $400, send her a text question. She will send you a video call. I'm sorry, video answer. Or we don't know how long that is but okay but here's the one that everybody was talking about for fifteen hundred dollars a minute she will be with you on a video call fifteen hundred dollars a minute with a 15 minute minimum so right there, $22,500 to talk to Candace Owens for 15 minutes. Okay. So for an hour, $90,000. That's, that's a lot of people's salary for the year. She could do that in one hour. I ain't knocking the hustle. I'm not. 
because you know me over here talking about black empowerment i should be happy over this she's getting her coin she is fleecing white supremacy or is she But it's funny, her categories, her categories, her 10 categories is hilarious because she's over here, celebrity. Okay. She's going to teach you how to get owned on social media by people in a wheelchair, Christina Applegate, and then delete the post culture because she's shown us how much she understands culture, especially black culture. She's told us and she showed us this. Okay. Okay. Entertainment. She's supposed to be taken seriously, but she's under the banner of entertainment. Hmm. They tell on themselves. Entrepreneurship. How? If you're going to if you're going to try, if I pay 15 minutes for that call and you try to tell me about Blexic, I'm hanging up the phone. And then going to get my ass kicked for giving away twenty two thousand five hundred dollars for you to lie to me about Blexic. And again, I gave her credit for starting it, but I don't see any real progress. But okay. I know somebody in the comment gonna tell me that Black Seek is the reason why a lot of black people left wrong. But we're not gonna do that. We're not gonna do that. Not today. Maybe one day. Faith and spiritual faith and spirituality. Okay. Um she 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 got owned on Israel, got fired, and now she's a Roman Catholic. That's another subject for another day. So, you know, I don't care. Um, Catholicism is a fraud, but we'll talk about that one day. We'll, we'll, we'll talk about that. We'll do that. And that might be members only. We'll see. Depends on how I feel that week. Media. She's going to teach you how to get fired from a media job that is lucrative. Okay. 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 She's also going to. I'm going to save that one. Parenting. She's going to teach you. You pay 15 minutes to have her give you parenting tips. Remember, she has a nanny. She lives in an affluent neighborhood in Nashville. And this is the same woman who on her way to London to be with her husband on vacation, left her kids in the airport with the nanny to go film a methed out Karen in the airport fighting with cops and she decided to try to admonish her white woman and the white woman the meth out Karen asked her if she was a black person <clears throat> so she was lucid enough to understand that Candace was beneath her okay politics the same woman who said that Vivek Ramaswamy was going to be the future of the Republican Party. And then we watched him go in front of Miss Ann and Steven Crowder and get thoroughly handled. Hmm. Okay. Relationships. She's going to teach you how to swirl. We ain't got to say nothing else about that. And YouTube creator. This is the same woman who, after she got fired from the Daily Wire, said she was going to start putting more content on her YouTube channel. Hasn't done it yet. <sighs> okay. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, we're going to do that. But like I said, I did research. Um, Y'all will be pleasantly surprised to see who is in. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> I think I'm allergic to cooning. Oh, Lord. Okay. There you go. Here's one of the investors in that app right there which is why i said she might be going to value team but don't hold me to that here you go now the main principal is someone called thomas ellsworth and it led me to this and you'll be quite surprised when you see one of these reviews there you go this was on may 6th so this was because I'm recording this on the 11th. This is about five days ago. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah. If she goes to Valuetainment, 
y'all should not there's thomas y'all should not i repeat y'all should not take her serious but we know some of you coons will take her serious because it's candace you never heard her before that's what a lot of y'all have told us you never heard her before she sounds great okay yeah but hey it's your money you do what you want i know one thing i ain't pushing this button but anyway, y'all, I'm going to get up out of here. You already know what to do. Share, like, and subscribe. That's right. Share, like, and subscribe because I'm not like other YouTubers. I'm different. Take care. Stay safe. I'm out. $1,500. Boy, you know what I could do with $1,500? That's a month's rent. You know what I could do with $1,500? I could buy toys and clothes for the baby. I could break off new black media. So we can reinvest in our platforms. She might as well have taken this $1,500 that she charged and go to OnlyFans. She'd make a boatload. <laughs>